thank you. Uh, this is a joint work with Alda, Carlos and Jorge Nuno. First of all, I have an, an important news to, uh, from the Portuguese conspiracy. <laughs> Let's see. On behalf of Ludus Association, I would like to invite all of you to come to Lisbon and to attend the G4G Europe at 2017. The proceedings of the last meeting are also available. Uh, you can buy it later if you want, uh, over here. Proceeding the meeting of 2017, uh, don't forget also the uh, second combinatorial game uh, theory colloquium. Now, uh, let's talk about the deck of cards. The uh, Portuguese pavement are, is very famous. The wavy patterns in Lisbon's Rocio Square were the first to be built in 1849. In uh, 214, this particular pavement was chosen by the Financial Times as one of the eight beautiful moments in cities. Uh, we have a lot of examples of this pattern and other types of patterns around the world. For instance, we can find the same pattern in Flores Island, one of the nine islands of the Azores archipelago in the middle of the Atlantic Ocean. We will focus on some sidewalks of these islands. And the common colors of the Portuguese pavement are white and black, of the basalt and the limestone used. The result is a large variety of patterns and we can study its symmetries. It is well known that we have four types of symmetry, mirror symmetry, uh, rotational symmetry, translational sy symmetry and glide reflection symmetry. It is also well known that we can classify a figure of the plane based on its symmetries. We, we can have uh, rosettes uh, only with rotation symmetries uh, or also with uh, mirror symmetries. And we have also the seven frieze groups and 17 wallpaper groups. For friezes and wallpapers, we, we used in this deck the three main notations. After the sidewalks of Lisbon, a deck of cards presented in G4G 11 and at 2014, uh, you can buy uh, this uh, deck outside if you want, we have a new deck of cards that is coming soon, the Azorian deck of cards. This deck of cards uh, highlights the traditional sidewalks of the nine islands of the Azores. Here we can see the back uh, of the cards on the right, each card of spades and earths contains two challenges to pinpoint the place where the pavement shown can be found and to identify its symmetries. The answers, the answers to these questions are in the cards of clubs and diamonds. Uh, we can find the place, the symmetries and the symmetry group using the three notations. To help with the classification of symmetries, we include two card mirrors. Here we have the nine islands. As we can see, the deck includes examples of all of nine islands. Let's see some examples. Let's visit Corvo. We can see uh, here a rosette uh, that is located over here. The uh, Corvo is the smallest island of the Azores. Uh, on the right, I put uh, in all examples some touristic details. Now let's uh, return to map and visit another island, I'm sorry. São Jorge. We find another rosette. Uh, this rosette has mirror symmetries. São Jorge is the land of wonderful cheeses. Uh, Fajans are also a visual symbol of the island. Are this Fajans are these tongues of uh, land. Now let's visit Pico. And uh, we find in this island this frieze with translational symmetries. Pico Mountain is the highest point in Portugal. It is also one of the seven natural wonders of Portugal. 
in Peak we find also nice wines. The landscape of vineyard culture uh, is a UNESCO uh, World Heritage Site. Now let's go to Terceira. We find this frieze with more symmetries. The historic center of Angra do Heroismo uh, is also a UNESCO World Heritage. Now let's go to Fayal. You can see this example of uh, other type of frieze. Uh, in Fayal, we can visit Capelinhos Volcano and its interpretation center, built hidden under the volcanic sands. Now let's visit uh, São Miguel. Here we can find uh, this uh, frieze near the Mosteiros Beach. Another example, a nice place to uh, drink tea uh, in Mosteiros, uh, in Porto Formoso, I'm sorry. This is other type of frieze. Here we find uh, this one near the Portas do Mar, the sea gates of Ponta Delgada. And I finish with this example from Povoação County. Uh, we find uh, here a rosette. And in, in um, the village of Furnas, we can find the famous hot springs. The cozido is a dish prepared by uh, lowering the pot in the hot spring. Just like this. Uh, here is the site of Ludus, the site of Visita Source, and my mail for further uh, information. Thank you.